a bit. I want to talk about the gamesmanship and the kidology because we're, we're actually on the Lakeside stage for the first time presenting together. So I get a real feel of how close and intimate it is. And I was thinking about those things you hear in commentary all the time, like he's slow playing him, he's up to a few mind games. But we never really get the feel what that's like or have it explained. So should we start what? with slow playing? That's the one as, as a fan comes into my head. Yeah, well, well slow play, you, uh, if, if a guy's fast, you can slow him up. Well, I'll be the fast player, you be the slow player. Okay. You, you give me an extreme example of it, OK? Uh, OK, OK. All right, OK. This will obviously be uh, 26, bed and breakfast. That's what I Here always... Go, it's a classic amateur player's score. Put them out. OK, so I'm fast, you're slow, and she was exactly okay. what happens. OK. And I just want to point something out to, to everybody watching at the moment. Um, the distance between the hockey and the edge of stage is just this. It looks much bigger on TV. That's it. So when you see the player standing behind... You could literally touch him in the shoulder. So it's very close. It's very intimate. So I'll be the fast player. Bobby, I'm on form. You've just lost four, okay. four sets in a row, right? Right. You need to do something. You're getting desperate, right? Okay. Here okay, we go. Okay, Bobby. Here we go. Oh, he's playing well, too. Look at that. Peppering. Peppering that. Look at that. Big, big 39. I'm happy. Right. Slow player. Okay. So you come off, and I'm going to think, let him wait. I'm not in a rush. Oh, I didn't score much, but it doesn't matter because it puts you off. Oh, number five there. One, That's no good. Two, oh, never mind. three, four, five. It's taking you 15 seconds to throw those. Right, but I haven't really finished yet. Now it's your turn. And then I'm in. I've had to wait. I've had time to think. I'm also acknowledging your game, which you're meant to play the board, right? Yeah. So it slows that right down. Obviously, Bobby, you won't put me off. Oh, you look at that. <laughs> Got the loose start because of that. But obviously, if I scored well and I was playing slower, yeah. then it would put you off more. But that slowing you up puts you out your rhythm mm -hmm. because dance is all about rhythm. W what about the walk back, right? Sh show me uh, okay, that because okay. sometimes there was one oh, yeah. player in particular does this. Yeah. But can you also mess up the eye line of the, uh, the, the player who's on top? What is it? Oh, look at that. Look at that. Right, you know, I had to go down there, didn't <laughs> Live television, that's you had down there, marvellous. <laughs> so anyway, you take your darts out. Now, I'm ready to... And I... So I've got to completely reset myself. Yeah, you've you got to really... That. Yeah, you've got to set yourself. All right, so Bobby walked into my island, got to reset myself. So let's say I was in double 16. Had to reset myself and you missed straight away. Okay, so the king of this, Bobby. I'll do right. an impression. You can tell me whether you know who it is, all right? Oh, okay. Okay, you take my mic. Right. Okay. There we go. Now let's guess who this is. Here we go. Yes, I like the stents there. <laughs> Chet Anky. Chet Anky. <laughs> fact. Brilliant. Right, OK, so we've dealt with how you can slow play when, when you're at the hockey. So this is all, it's not illegal, but it is gamesmanship. It's on the edge of the law. Sure. I've already demonstrated how close you are to the player at all times. It looks further away on TV. So what can you do from behind the dart player when you're not thrown that could put them off that, that people may not notice in television. Okay, if you're, you're, you're the dart okay. player and you're going to go and throw, okay? Yeah. I'll stand behind you because I'm right near you can... That's awful. What are you doing? You just tip your darts. You, <laughs> see. you just tip your darts. As you go, go, you, oh. go, oh, you go for a shot and, I, and, I, and as you're going... I'd want to I'd turn around and throw it this way. Yeah, but you can't. You what see. else can you do? You can also, you can flick your flights and go like this. <laughs> Bobby. Oh, but yeah. it does put you off. Yeah, it definitely does. Yeah, definitely they do does. actually, do, you actually do that. They do do it. You yeah. see it a lot. And some players here have done it. But they do it, they're, they're the masters at it. You can't really see what they're doing. But when I'm watching the game, I think he's slowed him up here. Yeah. He's buried him a little bit there. He's twisting his darts out. You, you, but there's no, there's no rule to say you can't no. do it. I, it. Surely, though, you get used to that. Because, you know, it happens enough time to you. The more you, you take someone like Martin Adams, 21 years here at the Lakeside, he's never going to fall for that in his quarterfinal tonight. Well, no. Um, you, the only thing that you hear when you're here. Now, when you play in these tournaments, you've got 20 balls in the line. So there's noise all the time.
and they're shouting, come on, Fred, come on, and you don't take no notes of it. But when you're up here, it's nice and quiet, and it's and, and a player requires 32, or Martin requires 32. Mm -hmm. And then some, as he's going to go for the double, some idiot shouts out, miss, miss. Should we try that? Go on, All right, you're on double 16. I'll be okay, the idiot. This is 16. easy casting. Right, I've only got two darts, right, but never mind. I've got two darts, okay? Right, here we go. You ready? I'm going to try it to get right. Idiot! It does work as yeah, it That's quite good. <laughs> you go, ready? You smell! <laughs> it work? Yeah, it does work, yeah. Come on! But it does work. Come it on, works. John Lowe. <laughs> Sorry, that's a bit crude. Right, that's fantastic. That's wonderful stuff. So, it's more the crowd that's your enemy than anyone you're playing against, because I suppose when they're trying the mind games, it's the ultimate compliment because you're on top as a player. That's right, and he just put the guy off. All the, the idea of this game is to beat your opponent. Mm. Now, the way you do it, I don't think it's right sometimes, but there's nothing in the rule book that says you can't. That is, that is the problem. Yeah. They don't all do it, but it does happen. Okay. Probably they've, 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 got, they've had that trouble getting here in the playoffs and all that. People try anything to win now. Yeah. But like I say, the first thing was you shouting that out to me. Yeah. Sorry you call that, me an idiot or something? <laughs> <laughs> right.